What's up, YouTube? Technically five for five today, but one was a break even trade. Let's get to it. All right, as always, if you want to watch any of these trades live, go over to Twitch, click on my name, scroll down, click the little videos button. There's a little scroll down. It says highlights, click highlights, and they're all in there. All the live trades that I've taken since I've been on Twitch, go check them out over there. Gonna jump right into this. Always don't forget to like and subscribe. Always appreciate the support. Cron, first trade, annoying. Um, this thing owes me money from back in the past before I knew what I was doing. It took a lot of my money. I was trying to get some of it back, but as you can see, we got in absolutely no pullback and started to go higher. So we took it off and we just let it be. As you can see, I think just grinded higher all day. Hopefully it's in play tomorrow. Gives us a chance to get some of our money back. POLA, we actually just traded this again. Um, a little frustrated because it ended up working out after it faked this out a little bit, but right there at the bell, um, decent little pop up through the half dollar, took it. Uh, pretty much covered it coming back down into that previous resistance. And then the trade that we just took, nice little pop off the bottom on some good volume up through previous resistance. Uh, took it up near 750. Um, when we got in, it didn't break 750. Right after we got in, it finally went up and broke it. Or did it? Yeah, 757.98. And as you can see, it did come down. Um, and we had an order out here uh, close to the whole dollar of seven, um, but it started to go back up. So we took it off and then Pretty much right after we got out, it went up, tested 746, and then died. So a little frustrating on that one. We also took a trade on AMD, which was a pretty decent one. Um, caught the beginning, basically this first move. I guess it was kind of volume out of nowhere uh, in hindsight. Didn't really notice that. I just figured AMD it wasn't. But a lot of volume. Uh, scaled into it real quick, took it on the drop, and as you can see, it went higher. It did come back down to that same area after it tried to go higher, but as you can see, uh, this thing worked its way higher for most of the day. Looks pretty heavy at the moment. Looks like it might fall over, but yeah, we're not in that anymore. And then we took one trade on DWAC. Uh, went super small on this one, knowing uh, what this one's capable of. It was kind of volume out of nowhere as well. Pretty nice previous resistance from the high of day of yesterday, as well as some of the resistance from opening today. And... As you can see, it was a really nice move. Just kind of watched the price action, felt the top, and then covered into the wash. As you can see, I was pretty close. to tried to go higher and then ultimately failed. So that's all I got for you. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Always appreciate the support. Probably sound hear that I sound funny. Just got another filling up here as well as everything ready for the crown up here. It's all, I have a temporary crown in there. I have to go back in two weeks. They'll pop out the temporary crown, put it in the real crown, and I'll be finally all caught up on my mouth being a piece of crap. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Like I've said 10 million times at this point, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below or find me on Discord, find me on Twitter. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.